is the Realme GT 7 Pro and it's India's first Snapdragon 8 Elite phone. How does it perform in real life and benchmarks? Let's see. The phone scored over 2.7 million in Antutu but it didn't quite reach the 3 million mark promised. The Geekbench numbers are also super impressive. However, we noticed that the phone throttled quite a bit in the CPU throttling test. So we decided to put it through more GPU stress tests to assess its power. In both 3D Mark Wildlife and Solar Base stress tests, the phone gave a respectable 69-70% to 70 of stability, showcasing good GPU power, but the phone got unbearably hot. In real world, the game breezed through 30 minutes of Genshin Impact with GT mode turned on at 60 FPS without getting too warm. Even in BGMI, we ran the game at Smooth Plus Extreme Plus settings and it consistently gave us 88 to 90 FPS without getting too hot. So it seems that the Realme GT7 Pro is definitely a beast of a gaming phone, but it's not well optimized for benchmarks. What do you think of the GT7 Pro and the Snapdragon 8 Elite's performance?